Hello students, how are you? I hope you all are safe and keeping well. So here today, we are going to learn about a new story, a new topic in our English, English book. So let us see what the topic is. But before we start with the topic, children, I just want you all to know that, do you all know that when we go to be beach, I hope and I know you all love going to beach, right? So when we go to beach, what we do, what we love to do, we carry all our things and what we generally do. We make sand castles, right? You love making sand castles, right? Digging and putting one on the top, right? So we all love digging and playing with sand and making our own new nice castles. Now, let us see. The story is related to sand castle only. Children, make a note that this is an SDL chapter. So, let us start. I'll just share my screen. Okay. The House of Sand. Chapter number 13. The House of Sand. Now, let us see. Look at our fine house, cried Shaker. It's the finest house on the beach, replied Balu. So now here, children, Shaker and Balu, they are friends. They both of both of them are friends, and they both are making sand castle. Yes, yes, a house of sand. And we made it. So I'll read it again. Look at our fine house, cried Shaker. It's the finest house on the beach, replied Balu. And we made it. Yes, they both said, yes, we made it. We, we made a nice house. The two boys sat on the sand and looked at the house. They both were gazing. They both were looking at the house. It was built on sand and palm leaves. There was a little wall all around. There was a little wall all around it and a tall tower in the middle. Can we see? See in the picture, there was little wall, fence kind of, and there was a tall tower in between. It's a good house, said Ballo, but look at the sea. The water is getting closer. A house will be washed away. Now, what Balu said, the, yes, a house is very nice, but see, the water is so close. So our house will wash away, it will splash on our house and it will be no more. So then we can make another one, Shaker said with a smile. Now over here, Shaker smiled and Shaker said, it's okay. If our house is washed away, we'll make a new one. Some weeks after. Some weeks after this, Shekhar went away. His parents sent him to a school high up in the hill. High up in the hills. Now, parents asked, like parents made Shekhar to go to a big school. Okay. Which was on up high hills. Now, let us see what happens. Can I go to father, said Balu to his father. No, my boy, you cannot, you can't go. So Balu asked for permission, like can even I want to go with my friend Shekhar. But father said, no dear, we can't go. I can't send you and you can't go. I am old. I have no money to send you away to school. Now, father said, I am old and I don't have enough money that you go to that school. So, Shekhar went away and Balu stayed behind. So, Balu was still staying there near that beach and Shekhar went away. Balu stayed by the beach. He went to a small school for a few years, but his family was poor. They they were unable to they were unable to send uh, balu to school so they stopped schooling 
and went to work now okay small school for a few years but his family was poor balu left school and went for work as family was poor family needed money so what balu did balu balu just went to school for 2 to 3 years and then he stopped his studies and he started working so that he can help he worked hard but did not earn much money he used to work very hard but he used to get less money so that only only he was able to eat and stay that's it he was not living a nice nice life no shekhar stayed at a school in the hills when he grew older he went to college he too went to work even he started working even shekhar started working but shekhar completed school and college okay and balu stopped studies uh, he's uh, balu stopped his studies in early age okay then what happens he too went to work 3 years went by shekha became very rich shekha was very rich one day shekha returned to the beach he came to see his old place place where he used to love to be he walked along the beach he was walking along the beach a man came towards him he was walking along the beach and a man came and what he asked ballu is that you asked shekhar shekhar asked ballu that is that you shekhar cried ballu the two old friends hugged each other they both recognized each other and they both hugged each other do you remember our sand house asked shekhar what did shekhar asked shekhar asked do you remember we used to make sand house sand house yes said ballu shall we build a real house asked shekhar shekhar said shall we build a nice new permanent house but i have no money said ballu ballu said i don't have any money i have money said shekhar shekhar said i have money so i'll help and we will build a house they sat on a rock and watched the boats sailing far far away they used to sit on rocks and they used to watch boats going here and there meanwhile the work the house work was going on all the construction work was going on Six months later, their house was ready. Now, after six months, house was ready to live. It's a fine house," said Balu. "The sea cannot wash it away." Now, what Balu said? "It's a fine house, and now sea can't wash it away because earlier, do you remember when they were small?" he he was tense that water will come and water will be splashed on our house and our house will be washed up so in same manner even he was worried that time but now he grew older and he is no more worried about it okay so i hope children you understood the story and will meet again in for the next session Bye